Times are good at Turf Moor after a spell of disappointing draws. The hosts have won five of the last six league games and Vasson Company's men haven't lost in the league since early August. With that on top of the Clarence boss saying he still has a few more presents to open, Burnley are looking dangerous. Connor Roberts drops to the bench, Vitinho comes in, as does Jack Cork, the change of system seeing Bastien drop to the bench. This is a side beginning to revel in being ruthless. The Millers complete their hat-trick of away games tonight and boss Matt Taylor has demanded his side be more proactive than they were at Cardiff. Three changes for them, with Norton Cuffey, a Dauphin, and the experienced Grant Hall starting. It's Burnley against Rotherham. It's been a lively start. A bit uh, awkward in that Burnley back line, but they've got away with it. Bramall did well, and that's a wonderful spin of the ball to this right-hand side. Two in the centre, could be a big chance, it's an opening goal! Of course it was going to be him! Three bids in the summer from Burnley for Ben Wiles. He didn't move, and now he puts Rotherham in the lead at Turf Moor. Completely unmarked. All the time in the world, Rathbone's switch of play out to non Cuffey on the right-hand side is brilliant. The cross is fantastic as well. The defending isn't, but the header is. Brilliant robber and move. They're in front. On his side, they've shown they can come back this season. Howard Bellis goes to this right-hand side. Attempt to cross out for a corner kick. In comes the Burnley corner, nodded towards goal, cleared away off the line. It didn't seem to cross it. Brownhill moves it across, cleared away by Rotherham. And Lee Doty didn't seem to be too tempted. Hacked away. Take a look at this. And just about clear. Cheeky grin from the uh, Rotherham manager there. Pressure being applied. No free kick being given and Brownhill able to scoop it over the top. The dangerous Nathan Teller. Drops to the right boot. In comes the cross. Could be a big chance here. It's a tame first shot. It's a simple enough save. Good Munson. Might be frustrated with himself here. Had to leap a little bit for it. Vizinho. Well crossed in. Another by uh, Harding. Barley's up. He's back to his goalkeeper who gets his boot through it. Rotherham keeping the pressure on and this is brilliant from Washington. Washington, good stop from the keeper. Arianek Muric. Washington just kept going and kept going. That's a quality stop. Burnley's next game, of course, they head to Bramall Lane. Take on that man's side. Plenty of action to come tonight before that. Virginia again. With Munson. Switches it beautifully. Knocked up. Rodriguez is unmarked. The easiest goal he'll score this season. His ninth of the term, his teammate gets a thank you tap on the cheek. That's a lovely ball, that's a lovely touch, that's an easy finish. Burnley deservedly back in it. This is such a classy ball across. Burnley draw level. Thanks in truth to some lovely play. One apiece. More to play for. Well, a man who's been out since the start of October. He joins the field. Bennett can be a dangerous character. He seems to be a man deep in thought there, Vance on company. 
Stranger dealt with fairly quickly. Wiles will chase it down. And now Ogbené opens those legs up. It's Ogbené still going. Ogbené! He's back with a bang. His sixth of the season. Doesn't appear to be carrying any hamstring issue now. His name chanted by those travelling Rotherham fans. Burnley make a rod for their own back. Well, Bene charges forward. Somehow keeps going and finds exactly the right spot. His first involvement in ages. And it ends in a goal. Rotherham lead. Through a mix of poor Burnley play and plenty of desire. Well, his game plan has been working a treat so far this evening. It's going to be a free kick. Cohen Bramble going to be booked here as well. Fair play to both of them. They calm things down. Vance and Company and Bramble. Undoubtedly a foul. Almost dangerous again. And I think that's Bramble who's gone in again on Connor Roberts. And what's the referee Lee Doughty going to do here? Well, that's what he's going to do. A first career yellow red card, I should say, for Cohen Bramble. Chasing that one down. The first, undoubtedly, a yellow card, that one. Well, a little bit more tricky for that man's side. Well, we're in a bit of bother now. Brownhill comes out to this left-hand side. Zaruri. Tricking his way through, plays the ball into the centre. Bounces down, real pressure on here from Burnley. Wiles trying to get his leg in, a diving header, somehow kept out and cleared away. Was that Johansson? Was that a Rotherham head? It was both, in fact, I think. Johansson does so well, though. Reacts very quickly, the keeper. Still prodding and poking. Charging into the penalty area now, Manuel Benson. Oh, what a finish! Burnley a level. And it's the super sub yet again. Four substitute appearances in four. Now three goals and two assists in that spell. They're delighted. Burnley a level. How many more times is this man going to leave the dugout? And keep doing it. A great run. An even better finish. And in the first minute of out of time, it's all square. And of course, we get well over eight or nine minutes of out of time in this game. Pressure still being applied. Burnley down this right-hand side now. Good defending. I don't think once the throw, he's not going to get it. Brownhill, shot saved. There the shot go! They've done it. They've done it late again. The absolute delight on the manager's face, the delight on the fans' face, the delight on the players' faces. They just keep going. And surely they've won this one now. Brownhill's shot. Saved by Johansson, but the long leg of Dervish Oglu has won Burnley the game again. Remarkable. Absolutely remarkable. Just tapped in. And the three points surely staying at Turf Moor. 
Look at his face. And that's the final whistle. Unbelievable. Hugs for the backroom staff from Vance on Company. Matt Taylor must feel sick because his side, his tactic was working until the red card. A few words to think about that now. Bit of a shock who got the winner. High fives from Vance and Company for him. Yet again, he came off the bench to make such a massive difference. The experienced heads applauding their fans. Absolutely remarkable. Burnley win it late once more. In an incredible game. Burnley 3, Rotherham 2.